Hi. How are you? Good. Question. So I'm making stuffing for Thanksgiving this week. What's the secret ingredient that you put in your stuffing? Uh, oysters? Oysters, right. Why? Are you gonna put that in one of your stupid videos and call it your own recipe? Uh, no, no. Um, uh, what? what? I, I can't hear you. I, I'm going into a tunnel right now. Uh, the I can static. See you, idiot. We're FaceTiming. Uh, I'm sinking. Oh, it's hey. quicksand. Hey, it's quicksand. Oh. <laughs> What's up guys? Welcome back to a Thanksgiving edition of the Cheesy Does a Cooking Vlog. Today we're making an oyster and bacon stuffing. This is really easy, so don't screw this up. If you do, just say you were drunk. That excuse seems to work these days. We drank beer. We like beer. First, start with your vegetables. Here I have celery, shallots, thyme, and good old stupid parsley. People often ask me what my beef is with parsley. Well, let me tell you. Hmm. Twelve. Fajita? Chop your veggies using rock, paper, and scissors. Now cook four slices of bacon chopped into small pieces. Remove the bacon and drain the fat. Or you can keep it. Whatever. You turn your one pack into a two pack this year. You earn the right to stay warm during the winter. To the pan, add your shallots and celery. Cook until translucent. Then add a good pinch of salt and some black pepper. Mix it around and add about half a cup of white wine. I use a cheap wine because it's just for cooking, not because my Uber driver told me that cryptocurrency was a good idea. Reduce the wine down and add in about five sprigs of thyme. Then turn off the fire and add your bacon bits and oysters. My camera died, so unfortunately I don't have the part where I dove into the ocean and caught live fresh oysters while fighting off sharks and barracudas, so you're gonna have to take my word for it. Okay, all this is mixed, put this on the side. Next, grab your homemade cornbread. I'm not gonna show you how to make cornbread because a chef doesn't reveal all his secrets. Add three cups of cornbread to a large mixing bowl. Make sure you use a dry measuring cup for precise portions. A wet measuring cup is completely different and you'll screw this up. Add in your veggie oyster bacon mixture, the stupid parsley, and toss the salad. Next, melt half a stick of butter on a hot surface. Then add it in. Crack in one egg and a splash of cow titty juice. The egg and milk are optional. I personally like stuffing that's more moist and slightly cakey. If you like it dry and crackery, then skip the egg and milk. Okay, stuffing tip number two. Cook it outside of the bird. When you cook the stuffing in the turkey, you don't get any of those brown crispy bits. Also, it may get soggy. Stuffing is usually better when it's served on the side anyway. Preheat your oven to 400 degrees. While it's preheating, put your stuffing in the sun so it can get the tan before the tan. Once the oven is prepped, throw in your stuffing and Kevin bake in it for 30 minutes to an hour or until golden brown on top. Okay, it's been about 45 minutes and this baby is brown and ready to go. Plate this up with a little extra parsley some rosemary stems, and serve it with your Thanksgiving feast. Guys, I really like this take on stuffing. The oyster adds a salty, oceany flavor, the bacon gives it a nice crunch, and the cornbread is a sweeter touch compared to regular bread. Lastly, this stuffing is really versatile. Not only can you stuff your turkey and your bellies, you can also stuff a chicken, stuff a tackle, stuff an envelope mailed out to the most empathetic person you know, Stuff a bra, stuff a stocking stuffer, then stuff the stocking in your speedo when you're at the pool. That's it for today, guys. Make sure you look at us up. Follow me everywhere at Cheese It As A Cooking. As usual, the recipe and ingredients are in the link description below. So I'm gonna cook another special Thanksgiving themed recipe, which I'm gonna release on Monday morning so that you have until Thursday to cook it. And then I won't post anything on Thursday and I'll be back the following Thursday. So I hope that's okay with you guys. I'll have... Oh. My mom's FaceTiming again. Hi. Hi. I feel bad about earlier. You, my son. I should share my recipe with you. So I send you something. Did you get it? Yep, I got it. Go ahead, open it up.
Yay! <laughs> you can't laugh, Jack. You can't laugh. <laughs> I lifted my whole body.